Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about channel trading. Uh, first, the characteristic of channels. Channels are banded current trend following indicators. So what does that mean? As you may know, uh, price never moves like this in a straight line. It normally uh, has its ups and downs. Then it changes direction and goes the other way. So if you can find two lines for upper and lower uh, bands. The upper, I'm changing the upper one, I'm sorry. Uh, so the price moves between upper and lower bands. As you can see, goes low, goes high again. And then, and some place it breaks out and goes to the other way. So here again, you have another channel. Uh, and it goes in this channel again ups and down okay so back to the um, characteristics similar to other indicators they lagging so what does that mean because you don't know you are in channel until you know you have at least the uh, first couple of ups and downs then you realize okay the price is moving in this channel uh, they have an upper and a lower line, as I explained, and also upper and lower bands are at the equal distance from middle line, which, which is obvious because on some um, trading platforms like TradingView, you can see the middle line as well. Uh, the area between upper and lower lines is channel. So this is your channel. Okay. So... Um, The signals, the signals, uh, you get signal when the upper and the lower lines bounces back or the upper or lower line breakout. So at two different uh, scenario. First, when we moving in, a, in one trend, we are in the trend, when it bounces back, from upper or lower lines uh, it gives you a signal so a buy so a sell here buy here sell here and so on buy here again so uh, and when it breaks out from one uh, lower or upper band then it uh, can be a reversal then you can just follow the other channel if you can find a channel to trade, okay? Uh, different type of channels, uh, also there are different type of channels uh, which I try to cover them in next uh, videos. Uh, like, you know, Dungeon channels or, you know, Keltner or Fibonacci channels, which are very nice. Uh, something else that I should add is channels can be seen in trendy or sideway markets. So, uh, what does that mean? Look, let's have a look at the bigger picture. Sometimes price movement is like this. Then you can see we have the overall trend downward and then we have some minor consolidation trends in between. So in these situations, you know, uh, you may listen to sell signals for this one as well because as you uh, remember i always say follow the trends so in a downtrend always go for sell and for uptrend in uptrend go along but if you are an uh, aggressive um, trader or you can take more risk or you have enough experience you may go 
uh, against the trend as well. And in these situations, you know, when the, when the uh, minor trend here is up, then it will be a very good idea to take the sell signals as well. Um, or in another scenario, when we are not in a trendy market, so we are moving in a sideway market like this, then your channel is like this, and you can take both uh, sell and buy. Uh, yeah, this uh, that was all about the um, channel trading. Let's go and have a look at the chart to see if we can find some channels. Okay, this one is uh swiss france uh frank sorry and uh, japanese yen just gonna open a parallel channel here to see if we can see some channel movement so the first one look at this one as you can see it nicely moves between the upper and lower lines so and as we are in downtrend so we Take the cell here, another cell here, and very nicely continues. Or another one I can see. Even here, as you can see, in uptrend, so we go up here, another up here. Uh, let's have a look at another, another market. For example, like something like oil. Okay, you can see oil also been in a channel. So here, you can see touches the bottom, bottom, bottom. So these are very good points to enter the market anyway. Uh, the other types of channel, uh, which I will cover in other videos, um, like Fibonacci, the, for Fibonacci channel, there is a very nice setup. I want to explain that in uh future videos or you know other types which uh, normally named after their uh creator anyway like the dun chain or you know Kelta. uh let's have a look as at one of the indices as well so this one these indices you can see uh s p 500 so i'm gonna show you yeah, you can see in an uptrend, it nicely moves between the upper and lower band. And uh, even here, that was a very nice move inside the channel. As you can see. Um, yep. Yeah. So as you can see, the uh, channel trading is working very nicely. Maybe even on cryptos, we can try to see if it works or not. Yeah, you can see that this is Litecoin. And again, we can find nice channel movement here. Same as the other ones. Just moves between the channel, between the upper and lower bands. And then we have the breakouts, which are a good point. To, uh, but this was not a breakout. Breakout is when it goes the other side. So if we go back here, you can see, uh, let me add it down for channel here. Then we have this breakout here, which goes up, then very nice point to go long. Um, I hope you can use this in uh, channel trading strategy in your uh, tradings and you can um, make good profit out of it um, that was all for today have a nice day see you